out here doing some kayak fishing and the game plan for today is well on one hand I want to catch some dinner thus the popping cork but on the other hand I want to catch trophy trout boom big swim bait I've yet to catch a fish on this yet though I got a couple of bites but ooh, it looks pretty good get out there boys Woo! actually we had a little bit of a cold snap which is not good but at least the water is kind of kind of warm <clears throat> Dang it, boots. <clears throat> Let's rig up our popping cork just in case we need to make an emergency cast. Got that lake fork lures. I have a lot of faith in this shrimp. Even though it doesn't look like a shrimp, it's more like a fish. But it still works really well. You can see the color change. We're on top of this shallow grass right here. And then it turns like an emerald color and that's where it's deeper easy way to tell and there's osprey over there my favorite bird osprey there's one little guy first guy of the day knew there's some fish over here even if it is a dinker oh he's trying he's a fighting little dinker isn't it oh yeah buddy How's it going, my friend? Popping cork. It's about it's about four in the afternoon right now. Cold day, and you can still catch them on the popping cork. See you, buddy. That guy was hanging out in a school of mullet, and I still see that little school. There's one. Oh wow. Jeez, the dinker. Now, that's a trophy, baby. That is a trophy I've been waiting for all my life. I know I give this tip a lot, but it's just such an important tip. And that is just, if you see those weed lines, using a popping cork or whatever, cast about five feet out from that weed line, and that's sure to get you some bites. And if you're fishing like a soft plastic, you can cast onto the weeds and then bring it onto the deeper area such an easy way to get bites oh there's a bite oh, a dinker damn dude usually like I'm okay with catching dinkers it's fun to catch fish but shoot sometimes you a man can only take so many dinkers so this little fish was kind of the representation of the early part of this fishing trip like I said we had a bit of a cold snap so during dinkers. the spring break time uh, just, you know, right in time for spring break, make it a little bit cold for those spring breakers. And that just caused there to be a ton of little dinky fish around. In the morning where it was even colder, the fish were hanging out in the channels. Uh, these little dinkers were hanging out in the channels. And as it, the day went on and it warmed up, the dinks came onto the flats. And that's pretty much all you could catch. So that was what was happening here. And as I said earlier, this fishing trip didn't start till about 4 p.m. And the cool thing about fishing during the afternoon as opposed to going out in the morning is that in general the fishing is going to get better and better as the day goes on. So once you, if you get there at 4 it's going to continue to get better as that light begins to lower and you get towards sunset. As opposed to where in the morning you'll go out and the best time to fish is right, right at sun up and then it's going to get worse and worse into the afternoon. But in the back of my head I wanted to throw that big swim bait and I think it might work once we get closer to sundown. Oh, there he is. Dude, the first good fish and I lost it. Okay. Well, okay. Okay, no problem. No problem. No problem. We'll just catch him again. No problem. Oh, Osprey. He has a fish. Osprey, Osprey. Oh, he's scaring up. Tons of bait over there. That's where I need to go. Whoa, crazy guy. Crazy guy, crazy guy. What's up, crazy guy? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop, stop. 
crazy guy, 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 what's up, crazy guy? First decent fish, and you're out of here. Could have made him a dish, but I didn't think he'd be that delish. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna throw on the smaller version of the swim bait. It's still a big bait though. Just not as big. Should be able to cast it more easily as well. Boom, a little bit smaller. There we go. Maybe that osprey. Osprey knows where the fish are. He's eating one, so I guess he does. There's a fish and it's a good one. Wow, first cast. Kidding me, dude. What is it? It's saving the day is what it's doing. You're saving the day, buddy. You're saving the day with the big swim bait. Dude, if this is a trout, it's a mondo, but I think it's a red. Oh, it's a mondo trout, dude. Oh, it's a mondo. Who says mondo, but this is a big girl, dude. Oh my god, it's a big girl. First freaking cast, you gotta be kidding me. With the big swim bait. Oh my god, dude, it's a freaking big girl. It's a freaking big girl. Oh my gosh, this is a big one. Dude, this is why. This is why we throw this big bait. You're kidding me, man. Oh my gosh, just stay pinned. I don't know how I'm gonna land it. A little, a little bit of slack out. And the boat flipper. You think you guys think that's a good idea? Boat flip, boat flip, boat flip, boat flip. Oh, come, here. come here, big girl. Oh. Boat flip! Oh yeah, the big trout. Holy cow, that's a big girl. You're kidding me, dude. Oh wow, look at that. The big bait, dude. Big swim bait, that's what I'm talking about. Holy cow. That's why we threw that thing. And that is in there good. <sighs> Look at that, dude. That's what I'm talking about. First freaking cast. Oh my gosh, we almost lost her too. Let's get a measuremento. That is a 22. Dang, fat girl. That's what I'm talking about, thank you. Fatty on the big bait. That's why you throw a big bait. <laughs> First cast, dude. That's nuts. Just happened to be a big fish right there. I think I like this bait now. Hey, what up, fellers? So I just wanted to let you guys know that I finally did something I've been meaning to do for a long time, which is putting up Amazon affiliate links in my description and what those are is they're just links to Amazon connected to my account and they give me a small percentage just for a referral fee but the prices on the on the links are exactly the same prices as if you went to Amazon yourself and the cool thing about them is they're kind of like advertisements that I can put up that are actually pertinent to the video I posted so like in this video I was using that sweet swim bait that I actually like now, especially for big trout, considering big trout like to eat mostly bait fish like mullet. Uh, but I put a link up to that, and it's actually has to do with the video. So you can't beat that. And I hope you guys had a good spring break. Mine was pretty good, dude. We did a lot of fishing. It was a lot of fun. I got some good footage. So we still got videos to put out. So if you wanna check out something I used in the video, go check out those links. Thank you, and we'll see ya. No! Nothing happened. Come here, big girl. <laughs>